All right, so uh, I'm just testing out some new mic settings here, so uh, bear with me. But also, I had a whole other video planned today. Unfortunately, though, that would have to take place in the test place, and for some reason right now, the test place forces you to be level zero. So, you know, that kind of went out the window. So here we are. So as you well may very know, ver very well may... As you know, there's a level 81 shotgun called the Stevens DB, and I've only used this gun really a handful of games. The shotguns are fun to use, but double barrel really isn't my, uh... I need a lot more bullets to kill people in this game. But there's a feature that I found out about re- Okay. <laughs> But there's a feature that I found out about it recently that somehow I didn't know. And that's that you can change it from semi to burst. And what burst basically does is it utilizes both triggers on the shotgun to fire both shots instantly. So, you know, provided you can hit your shots. This, okay, I missed again. This thing is a sniper. It's literally just like a KS-23M. But I guess maybe a little bit quirkier than the KS-23M. <laughs> but I thought that, you know, while this is not remotely named after me, it do kind of got my name in it. So I figured we'd go ahead and give it a try here. You know, really, really give it a, give it a stretch of the imagination while using the burst, the burst thing selected. See what type of performance that we can get out of this. Honestly, so far, I'm really loving this. Oh my gosh, dude. If this is the type of content that you think that you'd like to see in the future, make sure that you subscribe to my channel. Currently, only about 10% of the people who YouTube recommends my videos to subscribe and then watch future videos. So if you could subscribe and then check out my other videos, make sure to do that. And keep in mind that there's going to be future content pretty similar to this. So like I said, if you like this type of content, make sure you subscribe. I don't really know what attachments that I need to put on this. I only put the skeleton grip just because, you know, it makes me aim in quicker. But this is kind of one of those guns that I don't like to slap on all kinds of scopes and stuff on it because it just makes it look pretty ugly. I mean, that's just personal pressure. Reference, obviously. Oh, how did I, how did I not kill him? There we go. If I mess that up. So I don't really know exactly what to, what to use on this. I see a lot of people that use slugs on this. I guess, you know, it's basically a BFG if you do that. I really don't know. I haven't tried that before, but I mean, I'm having fun with this. Like, you know, I'm just melting people at a distance. Look at this guy over here. Boom. Not dead. Ooh, 95 assists though from that distance. That's crazy. Oh shoot. Oh my gosh, dude. Now, this should be pretty easy to get kills with. I mean, obviously, it's basically just a one-hit kill from, you know, like a quarter way across the map. But it's not like... I don't know. The normal Stevens DB is okay, but really being able to have that burst shot and be able to really maximize your damage in a single bullet or shell. Well, two shells. You know what I mean. A single shot. There we go. Big brain. Really ups the uh, ups the damage, obviously. <laughs> but it becomes just one of those things where it's, it's pretty high risk, high reward. Like, if you miss that shot then you're like, you know, you have to wait another second or two to be able to reload. But if you hit that shot, I hit the shot, did no damage. All right, whatever. Guess my point is invalid now. No, but if you, if you hit that shot though, then, you know, easy kills for days. Also, we are so close to losing right now. Can I get one more kill? One more kill. That's all that I'm asking. I can't get one more kill. <gasps> There's someone right there too. If only I could just... Let's try slapping some optics on here. The, what is it? The Ismash. The Ismash sight, yes. I kind of like how the flash hider looks too. It's just like a ripped up piece of metal on the end of your barrel. I don't have any ammo types unlocked either. I've been tempted to buy one, but I'm not gonna do that. Ooh, these sights are kind of goofy. I think that these would work pretty good on a shotgun though, right? Maybe, I don't know. Can I get this cross map snipe? Uh, nope, but I did a bunch of damage though. That guy's probably bleeding pretty bad. Oh my god, please. Yeah, let's go. This is kind of more the map that this would be good for because it's a nice open area. Oh, there's so many people, please. Oh god, why is nobody shooting at me? I'm a ghost. Holy crap, dude. Triple kill. Let's keep this going. No. I have messed up my shot. <laughs> I'm okay. It's gonna be fine. So as you can imagine with this type of thing, it's really good for just taking on people one by one. Like, if I want to take out that guy, I didn't. But if I really wanted to, though, I, that's a teammate, okay? This guy. Yeah, there we go. If I wanted to take him out, that's great. Nobody else is around. Then I could sneak up on one of his buddies or something over here, maybe? Anybody? Nobody's over here. Oh my gosh. You get my point. Hopefully. It's really good for that type of scenario, but like unless you're really good at flying all over the place like some people in this game You know, it's a little bit hard to get multi kills, but when you do though, it feels so rewarding But then of course you have the inevitable feeling of oh my god. What am I doing with my life? 
But then you get that next multi kill and it's all better again. The wounds are healed. Yeah, I mean, this thing, this thing's just good. I like this. I like this a lot. I don't know about this site though. It looks kind of cool, but I'm not, I'm not having too much fun with it. Ooh, you think you're gonna hide in that garage? Boom, you're done. Ooh, you think you're gonna go hide in the garage too? Boom, I missed. I'm really, really tempted to buy slugs on this, but I know that I shouldn't, so I'm not going to. How many times do I have to hit this guy? What is going on? How many times, please? There we go. Man, this... Th <laughs> Dude, this thing is amazing. Uh, die. Okay, I bought slugs. I can still put it on burst. Are you kidding me? I've got to know. I've got to know. Is this what people do with my shotgun? No. Okay. So the first issue I'm going to notice about this is that... You're going to kind of get the same effect from just having the normal ammo on it or like birdshot or something, right? But obviously with a little bit less hit probability. But I assume that you could probably snipe better with this conversion. Oh, or not conversion. You know what I mean? Oh my gosh. I can't deny that this, this is, oh geez. I didn't even have the burst on and it's still one hit kills. What? A little bit. Kind of depends, I guess. Holy crap, I, I, I'm really loving this. This gun is like too much fun. It's like, I, I don't know if you've ever played Advanced Warfare before, but it's like that funny one-shot gun that was on there where like it was easy one taps, but if you miss, you're done. How far can I, st oh jeez, what? Oh. oh my gosh, this thing is hilarious. This thing is hilarious. You don't even have to compensate really for recoil or uh, range. It just snipes people. <laughs> I'm sorry, I did not know that this was this good. Dude, this thing is something else. I understand it now. I get why people use slugs on this. I'm living like Larry right now, man, I swear. 29 and 8. You know, that's not, you know, pro KD whatever, but like, you know, 29 kills with something I really don't use is like, that's not bad. I don't know who it was, but somebody told me recently about that PKA site having an alt aim and that's the part that's good with it. So yeah, what happens if we use this? Okay, maybe not the best scope for sniping, but let's see. Easy one taps for days. Oh my gosh. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. What can I say? Oh, dude, this thing's so good. This thing is okay. Okay. Hold on. Hold on a minute. Hold on. That didn't happen. That is a cool looking UMP though. Oh, dude, 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 dude. I think I found my new favorite gun for about 30 minutes until I get bored again. Man, this is, this is, this is shotgun on just, I don't even know what to say. I'm not trying to be repetitive or anything. This is just like, this is too much fun. Boom. Easy. <sighs> okay. I've been meaning to change my melee for days. Actually, hold on. Let me do that real quick. There we go. That's a little bit more like it. Now back to using the swag gun. You can even no scope with it. Well, I mean, obviously. There's really not too, too much else to say. I mean, it's... You know, it's a double barrel shotgun with slugs on it, and you can melt everybody with it. I mean, you see a guy, you point, and you click, and you miss both times. I mean, you see a guy, boom, he's dead. You see another guy, oh my god, so many bodies around here. You see another guy, boom, he's dead. A little bit self-explanatory, to be honest. So what about you? Are you the type of person to actually use this type of thing? I've seen tons of people using this before, so I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if there's a handful of you watching right now. But is this it? Is this is this why you use this? Because it's just a BFG with two barrels? Because I think that this is kind of a cool novelty, if anything. Not the most practical thing in the world, but somebody like me who gets bored of using guns pretty quick, I think that this is like something to be able to switch to and have a little bit of fun with. So like I said at the beginning of the video, if you enjoy this type of content, make sure that you subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. I have gotten my subscriber viewer percentages a little bit up, and I hope that that continues to rise alongside my views. I'm really happy that YouTube's been able to pick up my videos and even though that I do these videos every day I hope that I'm able to kind of bring you guys a bit of a unique perspective on certain things in the game And I hope that you guys are having fun watching these videos But again, thank you so much for watching subscribe if you enjoyed stay safe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace Shoot it. You gotta shoot it. I don't have any ammo. Help! I don't have ammo either. Help me! Here we go. <laughs> Help. That strong oh. man.